This is the Fadwa RM-VS1. This is a remote controller and this can be used to replace the original Sony remote. The reason I bought this is it has a record start and stop button. Inside you can see the circuit board. Here's the optocoupler and this is two 100 ohm resistors in parallel. This provides enough current from a 50 ohm output source to drive the optocoupler. And the optocoupler is output just as straight across the start stop button. This provides me some isolation from my transient generator. This is looking at the finish trigger for the new camera. This is the additional cable that I've added. It goes down to this BNC connector. Currently I've just got this triggering off of the ARB. This ARB is set to burst mode. I'm going to trigger this up and this is going to start the frequency counting at a one millisecond rate. Camera will capture that at 960 frames per second. We'll use this to determine the trigger latency. We'll do that a couple of times and we'll see how much jitter is in the trigger. So this is the results of my test. I ran three different sweeps. The first sweep required 81 milliseconds before the camera started recording the video. Second run was 154 milliseconds and then 128 milliseconds. Based on this, I think what I'm gonna do is program the transient generator to trigger the camera at about 200 milliseconds before the transient actually outputs. The one interesting thing about the camera is I know when I first played with it, I could not get the camera to re-trigger. I don't know what I did that uh, put it into this mode, but basically I can trigger the camera to start the recording, and after that, the camera is already ready for its next run. I can actually repeatedly press the record button, and the camera will automatically rearm, or they call it standby mode, without ever actually pressing the center button. I don't see a lot of information in the manual about how to use the remote. If you're using the Sony RX10, I hope you found this video useful. In the future, I hope to use it to test some new meters. Later.